whatever happened to my plan of getting quail? Today I'm going to try to answer that in full depth and possible plans. Alright. So whatever happened, the answer is I'm still getting them. I just haven't really been around to like planning anything recently. I've been so focused on some of my chicken videos and I still have a, uh, another documentary coming out in a few weeks that I'm really focused on getting together some ideas right now. So yeah, it's just been these, it's been a, just been like a rough last few weeks. And it certainly really has been fun. These last few weeks really haven't been fun. I mean, I've been dealing with Mr. Crower. Yeah, that mother clucker. Clucker, you get that? Clucker. Okay, not the F word. Cluck. As in a chicken's cluck. <laughs> you know, my intro. I think you might have heard that a few times. It's the second most viewed video on my channel. Okay. So, as you may know, owning a quail is just similar to owning a chicken. But it's different in so many ways, so I'm gonna have to do lots of research. So I've came up with three quail breeds I am intending to get. My goal is to get nine little quail. And yes, quail literally are like this big at full grown. And their eggs are literally like this big, so it's pretty small. Not even close to the size of a chicken egg. You can't even compare it to that. Like, there isn't any point of comparing it. Oh, come on camera, don't die. Well, yes, certainly anyway. I mean, she's not going birdie, at least I don't think so. Uh, yeah, it's just been like very busy. I just haven't been getting around to anything. But I do have uh, some plans for the coil coop, which is gonna be like, you know, like how those like little, like little uh, tug, tug trailer kind of things, I, I can't speak. Uh, those little tug trailer things that you just like tug with your arm. Well, those are gonna be a uh, a big part of what I'm gonna be doing. I'm actually gonna be tugging the uh, thing, or my uh, like every day. My it'll have like a really, really, really small yard attached to it. There'll be several areas for the quail to lay eggs. It'll be for comparison, it's smaller than the duck, coop, but it is still portable. I do have a chicken coop video coming out tomorrow about how to design one. <laughs> um, I'd be really crazy if I really wanted to design my own chicken coop. It's not I'm gonna do that. Cause you know that video would cost me thousands of dollars. And my plan is to be really budgetful here and I'm really just trying to pool as much money as I can that I that I don't currently have in my sitting in my wallet. I want to like collect money from a different source and then basically just burn it all in here, spending all of it on like quail food and quail cooping, housing, and then the quail themselves. Most of the quail that I plan on getting are probably about uh, five to fifteen dollars. Quail are certainly more expensive than chickens. The average quail costs close to twenty bucks. The average chicken costs around uh, I'm gonna say like five or six dollars. The only reason they're so cheap is because, well, first of all, chickens, some people think chickens aren't worth it. They are really worth it. I'll say, each of these chickens in the flock, you can't buy them, they're just too much money. I'd say each of them are worth billions, in my opinion. I mean, I can actually talk to chickens. I'm not wearing that shirt today. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. That's probably the cheapest chicken I have. <laughs> worth a whopping 550 billion. The rest of these are trillions, possibly, I don't know. I'm just making up random numbers at the point here, yeah. Quail are pretty expensive. <clears throat> Their food is a lot different than this. The duck's food is, they can actually eat chicken food, but the uh, quail, they can't. Plus they're gonna be in much different locations because as you can see, look the size comparison. Quail are this big. See the size comparison to Lamoth? About the same size as our foot. So, the three quail reveals. They are, a drum roll please. Button quail, Katunix quail, and bobwhite quail. Yes, I have all these quail names written down in a note. Katunix ending with an X are really hard. And they're 
They're hard to pronounce. They're hard to spell too. They uh. Here, let me just give you a little bit of info and insight on each of these quail. Uh, they have uh, the bob whites are more like for decoration, but I know they're call. I'll try my best. All right, you should have heard that. I mean, my whistling is very loud. There, that's a quail sound. It sounds very similar. In fact, I once was actually playing that with my vocal cords. Oh, when I was down on the quail farm, and they were like, is that a quail? And they said, no, it was me, it was me, it was me. Trust me, it is summer. All right. Yes, it is. Uh, the bob whites are like decorational, and they don't start laying until they're like a year and a half old. The cartoonics, like you get them, and six weeks later, you start seeing eggs. Like they're more the production type. I'm gonna be handling all the eggs, don't worry. Like the eggs, I'll be cleaning them, I'll be producing them, I'll be selling them at the stand. Yes, they're, these are more the productive type of uh, quail that tend to lay more of the eggs. Uh, then you have the other types of quail. Uh, I don't know, the button quail, they're just really small. The eggs are literally the size of a jelly bean. See, so yes, they're pretty small. Here, they're literally the size of like, they're, they're literally like half the size of this barred rock feather I have here. Off my back bones. Anyway, they're smaller than chickens by a lot. Quail are very small. They were never intended to be big animals. They were never intended to be on a farm. So yes, click subscribe and turn on notifications because I might be getting quail sometime in the next few years. If I haven't yet quit because, you know, High school, it sucks, what can I say? Been tons of homework, I mean, seriously. I have three pieces of assignments, I'm just ignoring them right now. Cause I don't care, okay? I really don't care. All right, I guess I must go do my homework. It's the chicken and I'm out of here today. Catch it tomorrow. But wait, I'll be spending an hour editing this video, so. The chicken out, I need to go do my homework. I'm the chicken and I'm out. I don't know why I said that so many times. The chicken out.